Um, if I want to solve this limit, basically what we're going to do here is I want to rewrite this as the following. The limit as x approaches 0, but I'm going to write it as sine 4x over x to the fourth times sine x. The reason I'm writing it like that is, isn't this sine x, sine x, sine x, sine x, sine, like four sine x's? And isn't this x, 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 x? So basically what you got to realize is, isn't this going to be 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, four sets of 1? So what you'll catch on to is since this is four sets of one, I'm not going to write it because it's a whole bunch of writing, you end up with simply one times, what do you get of sine zero? You get zero, and one times zero is zero. So realize that this right here, again, is sine x four times. This is x four times, and each one is a value of one. There's four sets of one. So you write one times one times one times one times one times zero. That's all you do.